Hey everybody, welcome back to Learn with Parka. I'm Chanel. And I'm Kelly. And we're here to bring you marketing insights for the staffing and recruiting industry. This month, we are taking a step back to pause and reflect on the gratitude that we have for our clients and our valued partners. Coming into the holiday season, it's just the perfect time to stop and reflect and look at all the progress that, that we've achieved with our clients this year, so far in 2019, with so much more to come, obviously, in 2020. The best is always yet to come. Um, but we wanna share with you a, a handful of case studies and examples of um, just the client work that we have done that have yielded um, really, really strong success. Everything from you know achieving top of funnel metrics like brand credibility, um, all the way down to to lead generation and actually moving the the needle from a sales perspective. Mm -hmm. uh, and so, Kelly, why don't you tee up our first example for this week? Absolutely. So this example gives a really good uh, play into how a lot of our clients find us. And like mm -hmm. Chanel said, we love to partner in tandem with people with the ideas and visions that they have and then the strategies that we know work really well mm -hmm. and make that happen. And so this client that we're going to speak about came to us based on a referral from another company. They focus on both executive search and consulting in the Bay Area and they focus on finance and accounting. Mm -hmm. So very, very honed in. They've been around for a number of years. They've got over 20 people on their team, incredibly established. And in the past, they had had a salary guide created with a really nice design and basically speaking to here are the specific salaries for the roles we place, uh, and they used it as a leave behind or kind of a, a sales tool in that way, but had never really launched it with a campaign. And so we brought to them the idea of how great a salary guide can be, mm -hmm. not only to your current network and audience, but also people you've never spoken with that mm -hmm. you want to have know about you yeah. on the client and on the candidate side. Because we like to say salary guides are sticky in a good way. <laughs> yeah. You know, everybody wants to know, am I making what I can make? And every company wants to know, am I competitive? Mm -hmm. And what are the trends going on within this industry? So yeah. we, oh, and I will say it takes a lot of time and effort and resources yeah. to create the salary guide. So to just mm -hmm. use it kind of as a back burner value add, maybe work it into some email conversations, it just doesn't feel like you're really milking it for all it's worth. And so yeah, a yeah. paid campaign is a great way to take it to the next level and actually get new leads. Absolutely. Yeah. So a few of the things we did in our campaign for them were surrounding communication with their existing audience. First of all, we wanted to make sure there was a landing page on their website and a thank you page so that people would actually fill out a form to get the salary guide, mm -hmm. to see who's downloading it. Uh, we did some email templates to come out from the company as well as messaging templates to provide to the actual recruiters mm -hmm. so they could send them in mails or emails to their direct contacts. Uh, and even things to, you know, the email signature, adding a call to action button where somebody could click on it and drive straight to the landing page. Mm -hmm. um, and then the really fun, fun stuff came into play with organic social and paid social, uh, like Chanel referenced, where we were able to get it out in front of a broader audience. So why don't you share with us about what happened when we did that? Yeah. So the beauty of a salary guide is that it is very much a, a valuable piece of content for both clients and candidates. And so we took the salary guide that was created and we distributed it through a client campaign and a candidate mm -hmm. campaign. And they were hyper targeted at specific titles, specific roles, all within the Bay Area. And the shocking thing is that the, the audience size was 25,000 people or less, which is very small for a, for a usual LinkedIn campaign. Typically, LinkedIn recommends between 100,000 and four or 500,000 people in an audience size, just so you're casting a wide enough net for your campaigns to perform well. Mm -hmm. um, but we, again, we hyper-targeted this thing. And long story short, we saw over 150 leads come in through the salary guide campaign in just the first 30 days. And so it just showed that people were very much compelled by this content. It caught their eye. They said, yes, I want to download this. And then they ultimately received that, that lead at the end of the day. Right. We got really great feedback from our client as those first leads started trickling in. Mm -hmm. of, Chanel, these are the people we want to see. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> I've looked up their LinkedIn profiles and it's spot on. And that's mm -hmm. really exciting. And also to note, some of the clients that we've launched salary guide campaigns for are not interested in candidates. So we mm -hmm. focus just on the client side yeah. mm -hmm. or vice versa, depending on what kind of a market you're in. And mm -hmm. naturally there's different types of lead generation on LinkedIn, you know, bottom of the funnel where they're literally expressing interest in talking to you about your services, as opposed to this is more of a middle of the funnel offering mm -hmm. of I wanna learn more about this piece of information, but now 
now they're on your radar, yeah. right? And now you can connect with them and engage in that conversation. And then of course you'd want to use the salary guide or any sort of ebook as a sales tool as well mm -hmm. for your recruiters to use in their follow-up conversation so it isn't salesy, right? So you're actually value adding, well you're providing, excuse me, yeah. value added content to your potential clients or candidates. Yeah. So we hope you've enjoyed story time with Kelly and Chanel. <laughs> we'll be back next week for another story. Um, but in the meantime, feel free to reach out to us on LinkedIn or visit parkermarketing.com to learn more. And we will see you next week.